Today's review of mountain goats. Like it and subscribe to Zapping Savage. This beautiful goat with big horns is an alpine ibex and lives right here. It's a bit too high, isn't it? Can you believe this is the natural habitat of all goats? Aurochs and Ibexes. Although 8.5 thousand years is not a short period for us, but it is an instant for evolution. So the domestic goats are well prepared for rock climbing too. The mountain goat is found among the steep and rugged mountains of northwestern North America from Idaho to Washington. through British Columbia and into South Central Alaska. The Ibex live high up, from 1,000 meters to 3,500 meters above sea level. And often it's a harsh region, where there are only rocks and almost no plants around. Few predators would think of climbing where the paths are the width of a matchbox. Besides, it requires serious physical training. Mountain goats are real masters of rock climbing. Even if they weigh up to 100 kilograms. They have a body that is slightly flattened at the sides. Which means they're comfortable to press against the rocks. In addition, they have well-developed pectoral muscles that easily control their muscular legs and easily move their owner not only forward but also up. The most interesting are their hooves, which can extend far enough and grasp rocks as if in a vise. Moreover, the hooves have suction cups Just take a look, the central part has a soft pad It's tight around the roughness, sticking to them in the edges of the hooves On the contrary, consist of a strong tissue and are able to maintain contact even with the minimum ledge on the rock. Which is why it may seem that the goat climbs literally nothing clinging. They have a unique coordination system. If a goat jumps on a ledge and feels it can't hold, it jumps further and further until it's stable.
It may seem dangerous, but all is under control. It can even go down a nearly vertical cliff. And the animal is perfectly fine. The mountain goat is a very versatile eater. Consuming lichens, ferns, grasses, herbs, shrubs, and deciduous or coniferous trees. In the spring and early summer, they follow the flush of nutritious new growth uphill. By summer, goats usually graze on grasses, lichens and low-growing shrubs in high alpine meadows. Minerals rich in the calcium that these animals need to stay strong and there's rock to get them. Their desire for salt is so extreme that even faced with this sheer drop, their need is overwhelming. Without these salts and minerals, their bones won't grow. Their nervous systems and muscles can't function. Movement and coordination can falter here by sensible. When you see a steep slope, you're probably terrified. But then you're no Ibex. There's a strong bond between mother and kid. And the kid will follow her wherever she goes. Bears, wolves, eagles, snow leopards are all predators of mountain goats, especially first year kids. Much of the mountain goat's behavior is a strategy to avoid these animals. Climbing on steep rocky slopes that other animals can't navigate is their most frequent form of defense. Females travel close behind kids where eagles might try to knock them off their feet. In the end, gravity and avalanches take more mountain goats than any animal seeking prey.
Like it and subscribe to Zapping Savage.